Hello, this is Better Ray Ben for Pixel Spank, and today I'm playing The Legend of the Mystical Ninja TM, which I thought came out in 1991, but it says here 1992, so I might be thinking of the original Japanese release, and this is the PAL release. Also, there's a kind of kite in the background, it's very pleasing. Let's, let's get in. This is supposed to be quite a good game, so I don't know how I'll react to this. It's not something I'm used to playing. That's a look. Hey, Kid Ying. Have you heard the news? What are you talking about? You know, about that beautiful girl. Oh, uh, you, you mean the ghost woman? Of the temple? Yeah, that hot ghost you wanna bang. That's the one. Uh, something terrible has happened. This is taking a turn. Oh no! Hey, no close-ups. That's no way for a good ghost to act. <laughs> she shouldn't hurt people. Intrigue. That ghost has some nerve. I'll show her that I'm a brave man. Talk is cheap. Let's go. I'm with you, Dr. Yang. I was trying to think who the character you play is, and I assume it's on the left, but I now realise it said two players, so it's t probably both. The Warlock Zone. Mystical Ghost. So is this a beat-em-up? Okay, alright. Alright, I know what that thing is. I've seen it in culture before. Actually... I'm not sure. I think it's a kind of rattle. All right. Oh. I can throw my money at people. I'll oh, press it. Oh, right. no, that's just the next player. Oh, no, they are enemies. I didn't think they were because they're not really attacking me, but... Fuck you, fish guy. Jesus Christ. The enemies do not fuck around in this. They they want you to die, but not not like actively so. Yo, oh, I'm just gonna leave. I've just realised where I could go. A strange cloud is coming from the north. I'm scared. Okay. Oh, ghosts have appeared. They are adorable. I I don't really wish to exercise them, but I must. For I am the mystical ninja who can jump, like, four foot in the air. Actually, that's quite impressive. He's not that tall. It's quite an impressive jump. I take it back. Mechanically, it's terrible, but physically, it's impressive. Easy, easy. Okay. Let's go. Horro. I think that means forest. This is dangerous. Territory. Be careful. Proceed with caution. Good to know. Oh my god. Oh my god, look at that. Look at it. It's beautiful. Haha! -ha! It was me all along. I like the fact that so far everything is a one hit kill. Um, makes me feel like the powerful ninja that I truly am. I'm a huge fan of quite how fast the enemies are respawning. Yeah. Don't get overwhelmed. You are strong. You are the mystical ninja. I don't know what any of the pickups do yet. I assume they just give you more points. Shit. Or maybe health? Let's find out. Shit. Okay, so yellow is full health. No. Red is full health, and then it, the, the background of said bar is yellow. 
Why did they do it that way? It used to be a little trick you could do in games like this where you what you would do is you, you'd play until you were almost dead with one character, then you'd switch to another character and let your first one die and it, it kind of kind of would get you like double the health. In fact now that I think about it, the game where where you could do that quite easily in was it was Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Which was itself a Konami game, and this game is also Konami. It's actually a little bit interesting. Which means it has no place on this channel, frankly. Fuck. What was that game? Yokai Watch, that's the one I'm thinking of. Oh shit. I was so distracted by that little elephant I just picked up that I. I couldn't focus. I am so near death. Alright, I now realise how to deal with these enemies. You have to look at where they're going to appear and not go there. Nothing heals you! I've got POW 1 though. Well, I am doomed to die. So I'm going to spend all my money attacking this woman genie. Shit! Please tell me I'm... No. Game game over. You get one life. One repeat. From the end of previous journey. Wow. So this is a, a harsh reset. Let's see what you can buy. Welcome. We have everything you need. Would you like to buy something? Yes. Straw sandals, 20. Pizza is more than the sandals. And bombs are the same as pizza. I'll take the sandals, I guess. Um, obviously, the X button was the leave button. One would assume that makes you slightly faster. This is a weird game. The ghost woman of Horo Temple is very strong. You must be a must be a way to beat her. Okay. Thanks for that help there. Is this a secret route? No. I bet if I could read that, it would be useful in some fashion. Such a dick move to make him drop the fish and then make it look like the fish is a power-up. I bet that that cat, I've just realised what it is. They normally hold coins, don't they, and they're lucky. I bet they um, they give you more money than than like the ones they tend to drop. That's my guess. I'm a fortune teller. I'll tell you. You are a hero of this story, aren't you? You will do a good job. You're going slightly racist throughout your long journey. Um, okay. Thank you, Mr. Fortune Teller. I feel like that breaks the long tradition of fortune tellers on in games being 100% accurate and useful. We are not open yet. Please come later. Or sometimes not at all. It's like another shop. That's a bookshop. We will open soon, just a moment. Another part of a long tradition in video games of having an inexplicable pawn shop. Actually, that's more of an anime thing, I feel. Um. Oh, you can't, you can't jump off the edge. Oi! Damn it. I think that guy's throwing out menus to a restaurant. Huh. When is this game set? Because it... I've now realised... It's, ob it's obviously looks like it's deep in the past, but also... You can buy pizza. Oh, I lost money for fighting her. 
I lost, I lost a hundred dollars. It's a huge loss. Is this my house and can I heal her? This is your house. I learned nothing from that menu. I haven't worked out what those scrolls do. They might well be paper money. Strange cloud is coming from the north. I'm scared. Yeah, I know you're scared. Disappear into me. Yep, she definitely did that again. Now this time, I'm going to go in the shrine. Ah! With all the fuss over the ghosts, nobody's hiring. Is that a job centre? Again, I feel a very modern concept. Ah! I'm willing to bet that this restaurant will be able to heal me. And I really need it because I'm frankly dying. Welcome. I'm seeing sushi. Actually, that... I assume it's sushi. I've only actually ever really seen that in Pokemon Snap. But in that, it was sushi. Ow. Rough noise. Welcome. Everything is delicious here. Would you like something to eat? Yeah, what you got? What does it do? Well, that one healed me to full health. And it was the cheapest one. Or I'm empty on health. I still can't read the health bar. This is a weird touch that you can go in everywhere. There <laughs> are a lot of ghosts in the maze now. It's dangerous. Don't go in. I feel like a lot of these places will open up. Not when, but if I defeat the uh, the dangerous territory place. I got full health this time. I've been I've been over the not cautious, but trying to grab everything going through these areas. It I need to mainly focus on like getting where I'm going. Although I'm now realizing that those those fire spirits they do persist. could be an issue. Height is everything when there could be potentially deathly platforms below. One of these days I'll learn to wait when I ring that bell. Right, now, the umbrellas, once they're on the floor, they're no threat. I just realise they have arms. I've got the power of the elephant now, that's, that's going to be useful. Son of a bitch. That was a, that was a panic coin. In. Right, here we go. I'm at this now with a good bit of health. I got the elephant and I got the sandals, which might be useful. Right, there's no wall to get on there. Nothing there either. Now, the key to these boss fights is to beat the shit out of your enemy. Nope, that's a one-hit kill as well. Where do you want to continue? Elephant 1. Raccoon dog. I... I, I don't know. I've, well, I'm guessing the elephant is where I picked up the elephant. But the raccoon dog... Was that the thing at the start of the shrine? I don't... I don't know. Maybe the reason I, I I think this game is good is because I've heard of it. But the reason I've actually heard of it is because it's secretly terribly translated. <laughs> right. Oh. Okay. So I've got more health this... Well... I think I had l l low health last time, and that's why they killed me in one hit. I'm going to go over this side now. Right, if I can't hit her... Shit. Alright, they don't, they don't instant kill you, at least. 
They're super hard to dodge because you can't really jump. How do I exercise this demon? Is it money you want? Right. Okay. Seems fair. I'm going to end. Password. Z plus... Fuck. What is that? Right. Good news is, I have a list of cheats here. One of them gives unlimited hamburgers. No idea what hamburgers do. Uh, but there's one for level passwords. Penultimate level plus... Weirdly, the so the the passwords like so there's a password here that says to resume level. It's two, three. It's a it's about thirty digits long. Is this is it saved it or is this right? From the end of previous journey from logbook entry. Ah, here we go. Yeah, so basically one password is the entire length of that. The level passwords aren't. The level passwords are short, but like the cheat codes are incredible. Um, I don't know. I'm just going to jump to... I was going to jump to level 5, but apparently the, on this list, there's passwords for level 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, skip 7... Six, eight, and nine. I would have gone to seven. Right, let's go for four. Four seems easy. So that's going to require a W. Look at this keyboard. It's uncanny in that there's no A. Or C, it, but it skips a bunch of letters, but not the usual letters. You'd think it would skip I, which well it does, fair enough. But Christ, this is hard to look at, right? I need a, I need an uppercase W. That's, don't don't just don't think about it too hard. That seems to be the key. A colon, a three. I tell you, th this can make incredibly secure passwords. I'll give them credit for that. No one's guessing them. Oh, that's weird. So as soon as you put the password in, it does it. So this is a higher level. Still very much the same shtick, though, isn't it? Like, it started just sort of on the beach. Usual fare. <laughs> just between you and me. If you use the command up, up, down, LR, LR, BA, that's the Konami code, nothing will happen. What a dick thing to do. I bet his neighbour lies about it. <laughs> there are lots of deer running around here. Please be careful. Even if you must go out of your way to avoid them, do so. I've now realised, upon further inspection, it's a pipe. Because there's clearly a pipe in the inventory down there. I thought it was some, like, mystic ninja thing. Weirdly, you, you could kind of imagine it's like, oh yeah, they want they wanted the mystical ninja have, to have, like, throwing stars, but that was kind of violent. So he makes it so he throws coins, because kids, you know, don't have access to coins. And we thought a sword was too violent a weapon, so we gave him a, a, poke, a pipe that you can smoke. It, it's... It's just, it's full of questionable decisions. Christ. I'm dying, like, you know, on, like, level select. Welcome. Everything you need. Would you like to buy something? Yeah. Straw sandals. That's the ones I already, already, already got. Pizza. One up. It's 500. Now, I'm going to open up a guide to this game because I don't know what's going on. And in, in the guide, they start off normally by telling you what's going on. Hi, I'm Delbert. Too, too early. Game's a nice one to two player side scrolling game. You can play it alone or with a friend. Whoever holds control of the one will be Kid Yin. Player two will be Dr. Yang. 
Both had the same playing strengths. Well, not really, but mostly the same. The story... Uh, right. Oh, it's Kid Ying and Dr. Yang. We Yin and Yang. I get it, that's clever. That is, that is good, actually. Alright, attack. Jump. Not used. Attack again. Wait, there are two jump bu attack buttons? Uh, oh, you can change what judo you want to use? Okay, first of all... Right, the two attack buttons are the same thing. And then... If I had different judos... Th this is where I'd change it. And this is my inventory. Oh, I see Dr. Yang on the right and me on the left. Okay, right, that's fine. And then controls in actions. Oh, so you can use judo attacks in the action scenes. And it costs 10 scrolls to use. Oh, sc I've been picking up scrolls. No idea how many I've got. I'll probably figure it out in an action scene. Okay. Uh, all right. Um, I think that POW is what that means. And then what else? Uh, the snail, hold down. While holding down, you can snail on the... Okay. Ground pound. Uh, all right. The pig back attack, which is piggy back. Regular weapon... So, uh, which eventually gets leveled up, apparently. The death coin. Uh, costs $4 to use one. Well, that's not right. Uh, bombs are rubbish and therefore not necessary. Uh, enemy items. Uh, right, so, yeah, the scrolls, the coins, and... Oh, the, 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 the great cat is supposed to upgrade your level one at a time. Your weapon one level at a time. And it goes up to three. Sandals, these make you move faster and jump further. The more you buy, the faster you move. Uh, they deteriorate over time and you lose a pair if you get hit. Pizza, this to go item heals yourself automatically when you get near death for about four bars. Whole pizza, Jesus Christ. There's armor, helmets, time, uh, and hamburger. Oh, it's like pizza. Oh, so if I'd have done the unlimited hamburger cheat, I would essentially have full uh, unlimited lives. That's all right. Let's get to the action scene, shall we? If I can actually survive it, which, to be honest, is looking unlikely that I'll get there. Yeah, scroll. I'm going to use me some judo. Which I always find is such a laughable thing. Fucking deer. Is it wrong to kill a sacred deer? There was that film about it, but I didn't actually watch it. Shit. It doesn't spawn you in with any frames of invisibility. Invisibility? Invincibility. I reckon what I've done is I've actually walked the wrong way in this level and the overworld is one big open world and I'm actually slowly walking back to where I started. Look, my pipe's leveled up. How have I picked up so many fucking happy cats and never noticed that this happens? So apparently, yeah, then it, ah, I see. I bet I pick them up and die immediately every time. Ah, Christ, this is... This is harsh. I can't catch this man. It is incredibly fast. Nothing can be done. So it goes from pipe to longer pipe to... Son of a bitch. This game is hard as nails. It's apparently... A uh, this is where you can earn some cash. Try to master at least one game. Uh, that was the job center. I'm, I'm just looking at it. Right, I'm going to end again. Password. Sure. Wait, hang on. What passwords is it given? I'm going to start with an H. 
How's the password for the final level, weirdly? Alright, this time I'm going to painstakingly put in the code for unlimited hamburger burgers. It's going to take me about 10 minutes because it is incredibly long. And the way it worked for the last code I put in is as soon as I put it in, it just worked. So I'm hoping that it will, work. It will do the same for this one. VXZ. Trouble is, this is game facts and this is the exact sort of thing someone would put in to fuck with you. Okay, so there's, there's, they've taken out I's, but they put in lowercase L's and the letter, uh, the letter, the number one, just to, just to make it that little bit trickier. First cut time you get a code, you wouldn't know it was case sensitive. Uh, capital Y, N N. I bet I know why this keyboard is so big. I bet in the Japanese version of the game it uses these like kanji, I don't like saying that word, symbols, you know, Japanese symbols. And I bet there's a load more of them than there are R letters, which is why they've had to like, just increase the numbers so much. And then three plus, uh, exclamation mark, dollar sign, the fuck's a dollar sign obviously up there capital T and then a plus it's starting to get a bit iffy here because it's K K fortunately a lowercase so H to get me out of trouble G colon Uh oh god. Greater than or possibly less than symbol. Plus exclamation mark. Plus again a capital X followed by an at and then an R. I've now Okay, alright, so this has given me... I've got the yo-yo. I've also got three, uh, three wooden sandals. Actually, that's a, does it tell me in here? Oh yeah, I've got some bombs, I've got a straw hat, and 28 hamburgers. Oh look, there's Konami symbols on the, on the thing. This follows the classic Dark Souls formula as well, doesn't it? Where the game rewards you for being better at it. By, if you're good, you can have a higher level weapon, which makes the game easier. If you start doing badly, you you lose that. It's, it's like a punishment for trying to enjoy yourself. I got no idea where I'm going, but I'm guessing up is the general vibe. Did I start from up here? Maybe. Welcome. Welcome to the racetrack. Come on in. All right, let's play. Um, press the start key to begin. Um. Oh, this is a horse racetrack and I've just bet on the horse. The one I bet on was one to two odds. I lost. All right, let's bet again. So, apparently there are actually, well, does this mean I can bet on it each way? So, is this the favorite? So I'm betting on the yellow? Or is it? I don't know. I, I genuinely don't know. <laughs> I wish to leave. Also, I don't really know if I'm betting money on them. I'm not sure. This is why I don't gamble. I merely invest in stocks. If 
far better. Alright, welcome. This is the concentration game. On play 100. Yeah, I'll play. Good. Good luck. You'll need it. Who's first? Ness. Kid from Earthbound. It's actually a benefit to go second in this. So everyone knows that. Right, go. Yes, fucking A. Alright. Bollocks. So we've got cat, demon, woman, other thing. We've already had demon. Shit. Bitch got lucky. Ah. No, we haven't had her yet. We have had her, though. Good. Right. Boom. Nice. Not had him. We have had that cat, though. Damn it. How many cars do you, you have? Okay. Do you have an Omitsu card? No. I'll turn over a special card. Too bad, too bad. Alright, your grand prize money is $40. Thank you, come back again. Okay, that was a weird, weird little mini game. I think I lost $60. The Ot Otafu Army base is in the center of Yamato. Okay. So this feels very modern day, this area. And this shop does as well. Do you want to play any games? Yes, please. Which game do you want to play? All of them, eventually. Let's play Mole. Press the corresponding button on your control pad. Oh, I can do that. Slow course is easy, but you can get twice the score in the faster course. Alright, we'll start with slow, shall we? Huh. I have never played a game like this before. Like the whack-a-mole concept, incredibly easy. I've, but I've never done it on a modern con controller before. It would be so easy to do. I just hammered some buttons to see if you could uh, just have multiple hammers at once. You can't. Key is to unfocus your eyes. Uh, Alright, so the purple guys are worth more. Uh, so I made money. I see what the guide said about having a game that you're good at. Uh, yeah. Can I just come back or is this like a once per boss job? How does it work? Yeah. I, I, right, so it's 100 got mold 100 to play that so I actually lost money but on a higher level maybe more All right let's try paint the game here is painting the more you paint the higher the bonus but if you paint outside the lines or if you lay the paint on too thick you're fired do your best okay all right and I failed because it didn't actually tell me any of the buttons like I thought it might Alright, I'm going to play Goblin next, which, see my heart says it's about a goblin, my head says it's like a hungry hungry hippos kind of a thing and it's about eating food. When there is a vase on the head, push the B button to throw the ball into the vase. Keep the button pressed to throw the ball further, aim carefully, alright. This is incredibly difficult. I can't stress how hard this is. There's no depth perception at all. Okay, I got one in. This isn't... Wow. And you get $10. So you gotta get six in before you're even breaking even. My God. All right. Thank God this cheat I used started me with plenty of money, because otherwise I'd be boned, wouldn't I? 
Right, next step. I'm going to do the paint game again, but this time I'm actually going to not paint immediately. Okay, so I've got to paint within the lines. Oh, right, I see how this works now. By lay it on too thick, they, they mean don't um, double up. Wow, that was bad. 62. All right, so that's the one I could actually make money at. Should I have one more go? I will. But not where you think. I'm actually going to play the mole game on the highest difficulty. Fast course, please. I'm ready. Hit me with all you got, bitch. Pathetic. This is the trick. They keep it easy to make you think it, you're good at it, and then they, they, they hammer up the difficulty later on in the only section where you might actually make some money. Keep your eye out for the purple ones. They're, they're the money makers. All right. So, $148. I made money. It's good. It's good. I'm quids in. Right, quit while you're ahead or behind by several hundred dollars. I'm not really sure which. What have we got in here? More? Hey, you're back. How about a game? Throw free dice and guess higher. High and low. Less than 10 is low. Greater than 11 is high. The average of three dice is 12. Do you want to play? Yeah, yeah, okay. Place your bet. Which do you choose? A high? How much will you bet? 30. Well, I lost. Okay. All right, so they've already got this game wrong. First of all, you want to have about five five dice, and you want to make sure that you you place your bet, and then it shows you one or two dice, and then you then you bet again. That's how they get you. Right, let's go high again. Double or nothing, not quite. Yeah. All right. Quit while you're ahead. This is Konami getting that early taste of that sweet sweet pachinko money, isn't it? Ah, oh, cheeky bastards. You think it's Kirby hiding out there, but it's just a fat fuck. It's actually quite a satisfying go, yeah, I'll, I'll give him that. Bomb! Is it overkill? Possibly. Um, hang on, I've not already been here. I'm gonna try all these games. Hello, hey, don't you, why don't you keep a diary? of your travels. If you keep a diary, you'll be able to visit the places you've been to over and over. Do you want to keep a diary? Yeah, sure. Okay. I think the codes are so long because it stores like all of the information about you, like your your money, your lives and your equipment. And even perhaps I was going to say my judo moves. I haven't actually got uh, in fact, if I get one more scroll, I'll have enough. I'll have enough oomph to do some judo. Maybe it'll be a judo chop. Who knows? I can't actually find the level though. Like an action level. It. My instinct says that that park area there was like a, a, a separate world, and in each world there'll be like a kind of a boss to do. Ten dollar, please. I think I was killing those people. I wonder if you can't repeat a level once you've done it, and that's why by putting this cheat in, I can't really do anything. Ah, oh, my pipe got leveled down. Devastating. Christ, that level two to three though, that's it. That's a huge difference, which makes me think as well. On an unrelated note, that the this this park area is really where I need to be. I'm trying 
trying to figure out where I'm going. Welcome, hi, come on in. Would you like something to eat? No. No, I don't want a teriyaki or a burger. I don't think those two things should be sold in the same place, quite frankly. Ah, oh, God, remember theme parks? Ah, oh, could kill to go to a theme park. Just ride some rides, see some attractions, crowds of people, all having fun, enjoying life. Ah. Oh. Those were the days. Anyway, back to my isolation that we're all living in separately. Oh, good, I leveled up my yo-yo again. I'm lost. I'm so fucking lost. Please, God, help me. Send me a sign. Send me anything. Is it up here? In fact, it should just be up, shouldn't it? This place is fairly linear. Oh, here it is. I found it. How was that so difficult? How did I mess that up? Okay, I tell you, having having a weapon makes this game way fucking easier. And just having a bit of range. Oi. Ah. Apparently the... Uh, does exactly the same damage to bomb as the uh, what's it called the, the the coin shit. My yo-yo back. I think it does more damage. I beat a boss. I actually beat a boss. Also, no, I've lost two pairs of sandals and therefore I'm slower by a degree. Hard to say how much. Another game that had sandals that gave you a speed power up was Disney's Hercules. Coincidence? Yes. Okay. Did I win? Oh. Uh, the uh, army's hideout is in the center of Yamato. On the way to their hideout, Kid and Dr. Yang have to skillfully pass through a haunted maze filled with tricks and traps. I guess we're fighting the army now? Warlock Zone 4. Defeat Atafu. Is this like the Red Rimmin, Ar Rimmin Army where it's just secretly... Oh no, I've been here before. I accidentally unlocked this area. Myself. Don't overthink it. Just keep going. Still $10. $10. I don't like the fact that I keep calling it dollar and not dollars. It might I I just don't want to come off as accidentally racist. All right, there we go. I got my I got my speed back. Look at me. My fire. I can move. Shit. Shit. I lost it immediately. I regret everything. Oh, it's not a one hit to lose your speed. That's all right. The the yo 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 yo. I can I can get back on my. Own. Oh god, I'm down to pipe. That's not good. I reckon that sign tells you when you're like on a level transition, which is what makes me think I'm accidentally walking backwards through the game. This is not the linear kind of game where you can tell any direction. Yeah, because this is this is the start. All right, I'm I'm out. I'm done. Stopping. I can see it's a good game, but I feel like I need like a, con a well. Frankly, a walkthrough to know what I'm doing. Also, it's very very difficult. It it strikes me that it's kind of implied you're supposed to grind up money a bit and buy stuff, but ugh. ugh. Uh, so that was that was Mystical Ninja. Legend of the Mystical Ninja. In fact, uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.